two born and raised New Yorkers. We've painted the streets, but we've made that transition into the fine art world, establishing our own movement, which I like to call urban renaissance. We're creating some shit that's gonna hopefully resonate. We gotta like reclaim the public domain. What we're doing is, is shaking up society a little bit with a full MTA advertisement takeover. We want to tackle this exactly how any other full ad campaign will be. Let's do this. Advertising firms have been stealing graffiti tactics for years. We're not allowed to paint trains anymore. Who would have thought, you know, years later, fucking Target could have a whole car? So it's just taking back what they took from us and showing them how it's done, you know? We actually make this entire system run. Why do we have to pay and read your stuff? Doctors is more. Why is that nigga on the train for my whole life? You know, we're bombarded with products and services and, you know, we're not trying to sell you something. We're just trying to tell you something. You know, this is what we are. You know, this is who we are. We say you are New York, we are New York. We're like, we're all New York. We just like to uphold and show people the true New York way taking over what the public sees, the same way how all these ad campaigns flood your mind with all the garbage, you know, selling bullshit. So we figured we'd give them something cool to look at. Hopefully it stays in their minds and resonates for a long time. We took the MTA Arts for Transit initiative and we just put our own pieces. And then the maps, we chose to keep everything visible so people could actually use them. Everything plays perfect. Everything has an inverse to it. You have the black and white, and you have the white and black. It all works together once it's all laid out. We spread our word through here and hopefully it'll be like a virus and take over the world and it'll be something that people look forward to being a part of. The art speaks for itself. <laughs>